Do you know what I wish I had when I was younger? They always talk about mentorship and coaching. I didn't have much of that. And the coaches I had were the old school coaches that would make me do grass drills or push-ups if I did something wrong. Well, winning with humor is about having fun. And I've surrounded myself with people who are really successful. And one of the keys to that success I have found is they surround themselves with joy and happiness. It's not just about money, because money means nothing, unless you're having a good time. So my friend Mike Davis is a great example. This guy made a lot of money in computers. And someone offered to buy his business. He says, it's not for sale. And then they wrote a number down and they handed it to him. And he goes, okay, sold. <laughs> and what did he do with the money? <laughs> not something his wife wanted, he bought a winery. And the reason he bought the winery is he wanted to have people and host them and have fun. So he made the entire place, Davis Estates, it's the number one winery in Napa now. Why? Because people not only drink great wine and have a wonderful time with the food, the tasting menu, Mike is there almost all the time, hosting people, showing them around with a big smile on his face because he knows business is much better because people are gonna wanna come back to the person that made them laugh and gave them joy. And this is what we teach in Winning With Humor. I'll share these stories about people that I've met all along the way, all the way to the top they are, and every one of them has that one thing in common. There's no one at the top who is in a depressive state. There's no one at the top who has anxiety that runs them. It's a mindset, and their mindset is they win with humor. That's why they surround themselves with me.